Welcome to Sparky TV. This is Patrick from Mr. Sparky. Adding a ceiling fan to your home was a great decision. They're a great way to dramatically lower your energy bills while also adding a bit of style to a room. So let's get started. The easiest place to install a fan is where you have a light fixture. However, if the fan has a light, do a quick load calculation to determine if that circuit can handle the additional pull. If you overload the circuit, it could cause your breakers to trip or your outlets to get hot. Both are potential fire hazards. After determining your circuit can handle the additional load from your new fixture, here are the 10 steps to installing your ceiling fan. Step one, check for blade clearance. You'll need at least seven feet from the ground and your fan should at least be 12 inches from the ceiling. Most areas require an electrical permit because there is a safety and injury risk with any electrical work. Step two, turn off the power. Go to your electric panel or fuse box and turn off the electricity to the circuit you'll be working on. Even then, make sure the power is off with a voltage tester. Over 1,000 people are killed and thousands more are injured every year when working with their home's electricity. Please be careful. Step three, remove the existing light fixture. Unscrew, disconnect, and lower the existing fixture. Also, remember to check the junction box to make sure it is a UL approved fan rated box. This is very important for your safety. And because you're doing this all on a ladder, Take your time. Ladder accidents are one of the most common reasons for emergency room visits. Step four, if necessary, install a new junction box. Next, check that the box is securely tightened or your fan can wobble. That wobble will put stress on the fan and eventually could cause it to fall. Finally, wrap the cable's copper wire around the grounding screw inside the box. Step five, glue on your ceiling medallion if using one. Put adhesive on the ceiling medallion, pass the wires through it, and then set your medallion in place. You'll also need to fasten nails to act as reinforcement. Step six, mount your ceiling plate. Pull the wires through the center of the fan's metal ceiling plate and attach the plate to the box. Step seven, assemble your fan. Feed the wires from the fan's motor through the canopy, then set the canopy on top of the motor. Next, Pass the wires through the down rod pipe and insert the pipe into the top of the motor. Finally, tighten the screw on the side of the pipe. Please be on solid ground when doing this step. Step eight, connect the wires. Lift the fan and set the ball assembly into the ceiling plate. Next, join the two green wires to the bare copper wire coming from the cable. Then, join the two white wires followed by the two black wires using wire nuts or padlock wire connectors. Finish by putting the fan canopy flush against the ceiling and securing it with the supplied screws. Step nine, attach the blades and light fixture. Secure each fan blade to its bracket and the brackets to the motor. Next, plug the fan's light fixture housing into the wire from the fan's motor. Then add the light bulbs and shade and then your last step, Step 10, turn your power back on. When you do, if you notice any lights flickering, arcing, popping, or any other noise, you may have a potential fire hazard. It's important to shut your power off immediately and call a licensed electrician. Those are my 10 steps to installing a ceiling fan. Before beginning this project at your home, please take time to read the manufacturer's instructions. Not all fixtures are the same. Now, please note, I showed you how to do this with an existing light fixture. If you're hanging a fan where no electric is in place, this is a much more complicated project. If you encounter any troubles, we're standing by to help. Give us a call. You can always count on us for no malarkey service, guaranteeing you that we're on time, you'll see, or the repair is free. This is Patrick from Mr. Sparky and Sparky TV. Until next time, be safe out there.